Hi, my name is Eric. Two years ago, I started updating VTask, and boom, coronavirus came around, killed everyone. Okay, I'm just kidding. So the good news is VTax 2.5 is out. Everyone that's already had alliances for 2.2 has automatically been upgraded to 2.5 for free. Before I go into the new features, the website has been redesigned to cater for what I'm about to offer. So you can come to the site and get some free goodies, download templates from Cinema 4D to After Effects to Fusion to Houdini, 3D Max, name it, Maya, I'm all over the place. So here I've got different type of licensing going on. So now let's go back to the main issue, the reason why we're here. Vtax 2.5.0. Load it up. Boom. This is the new interface that you get. It's the same interface. Got new buttons down here. We'll come to that in a bit. Program editor has been simplified. And then you've got the clock as well. Also got the clip editor as well. So if I should add a media, if your video is selected, you can just click on clip editor. The top bar here is for scrubbing through the video. And then the orange part come here is smart enough to know what you want to do. And you can come to the end area you can get it and whilst you're trimming it automatically updating and giving you the duration over there as well you're not getting the total duration is one thing i have to tell you about we've got one minute 30 seconds but it's showing a total duration of one second every last item in a list is not calculated so always remember to put an input at the end and then you get your total duration you can still use the old way of clicking here to play it but you're not going to see it until you click here if you start to play anything it starts in preview mode really interesting to use this preview mode when you want to like schedule a radio program then you can do that 24 hour schedule and the command so you can see vita schedule function and if you put it and it must be the first item on the list please don't try to put it anywhere else if it's in auto mode and you start playing it will automatically change it to schedule mode and if you double click on it you can schedule for every one day change the period to seconds so every one second nobody's gonna do that oh every one minute every one hour day or week just a basic setup for scheduling that means the moment this play is gonna you schedule it for the next day you know normally when you're in auto mode and then you click red time you can see that all the dates changes there's two ways you can do the schedule you can leave it this way or you can manually set the dates for each if you go to schedule mode it locks the timing and it doesn't update and change the time for this and watch it if i update it only that one changes i'm gonna set everything to 10 seconds each to save time so i'm gonna set it to like in seconds and say every 30 seconds so let's treat this as our days so let's just start it and if it's in auto mode we just read time so the first one plays and you can see that immediately plays it reschedules it to the next time that's going to be 1302 so let's see what that brings up so the first one is ready to play again so that's it guys this is gonna do it forever so you can obviously go in there and change the settings to wherever it is one thing i want to talk about let's go to vmix so i'll show you something that was a bug when it was leaving the input after it's finished playing the whole list if i was supposed to connect to vmix right now and use api output start and read time you can see that if we play the video uh in vmix vmix it, it does it does remove the input but before in vitas 2.2 when the clip finished playing and the playlist finished or you stop it is it always leaves the last input there but that has been taken care of so if you stop it now it's going to remove it and automatically if you are in api mode then when you start it it will automatically output the vmix ndi and uh, if you were in ndi mode and you started it will start the vtax output that you're in when you're connected you can't preview vice versa when you preview you can't connect thanks for your time thank you for watching just go download it and give me a thumbs up my